Hello, I want to share something with you that Timken has developed uh, that we at NA Williams has been successfully using to help uh, our customers analyze their inventory of bearings, the bearing modules, the hub bearings, the kits, the sets, the seals, and the sensor cables. Uh, and this is based um, on your inventory and we compare it against product or vehicle registrations in your area. Um, basically, when we put your inventory up against Timken's sales rankings, the SKUs of them will be identified as um, either green, yellow, or red, with green being that the product life cycle for that area has yet to reach maturity. If it's yellow, uh, it's pretty much peaked, and this is the kind of the sweet spot for selling, uh, for maintaining these in your inventory. And if it's red, maybe something you want to check your inventory to see if this is uh, something that's still selling based on your turn rate. Um, so what we need from you would be your inventory. And what we've done here is this customer has sent us their inventory. I uh, put it here in column A, and then I added stock in column B here, which uh, as you'll see in a few minutes, uh, how that helps us in that. The extracted market we're using this analysis is the Georgia market. Uh, this is based on the area in which they this customer sales uh, locations are at. Once we get this custom uh, market demand inventory, uh, once we get the inventory fed into this thing, we compare it to the Timken part number. As you can see here, it's the sales rankings here. Uh, based on this, we have stocked over here. This is the customer's inventory uh, that they have in stock. If we had to turn information and their quantity on hands, it would really be great. We can do a complete analysis on that. However, you can see here that the, that the these items are most of the ones in the, the rankings here are in the green or the yellow. We have to kind of go down a little bit ways till we find us a red. Okay, here's one based uh, this number 200. Uh, it's peak demand years in the year 2000. To help make this go a little bit faster, we can actually come up here, sort all these by the, the uh, red. And you can see here, these are probably items based on inventory turns. If um, it should be stocked or not. If it's one that has very low turns, we may look at it as um, as returning it back in your annual Timken return. The advantage of this also is we can come in here and see that these items were not in the inventory uh, the customer sent to us. As you can see here, this is the number 20 rank, uh, 2009 peak demand year. So uh, it may be something we want to take a look at. It could be a, a product that um, could be on the shelf and the customer is missing sales on it right now. Um, it's really a great way to take a look at this. Nobody really in the industry has anything where it gets the peak demand year for the uh, the products. Um, but what we can do is we can just basically take your inventory uh, in Excel format, uh, compare it to this based on the area that you cover and vehicle registration so we can get this information back to you. So if you will, just contact your NA Williams sales rep and we'll see if we can uh, get this thing set up for you and get this information back to you. And uh, hopefully we can get Make sure you got the right inventory on your shelf to sell. Thanks.